Now Ashley Fox for the European Conservatives and Reformists. Two minutes, please. I want to express my disappointment, Mr. President, that yet again this Parliament is considering a report that preempts the ratification of the Lisbon Treaty. I wonder if the German Constitutional Court was still considering the treaty, whether we would be having this debate today. I suspect not. And I ask why the Czech Republic is treated differently. As the English author George Orwell might have observed, all member states are equal, but some are more equal than others. Mr. President, I want to speak against the setting up of a European diplomatic college. At a time when all member states face huge budgetary pressures, the EU should show restraint. We should act as guardians of the public purse. Our aim should be to spend public money prudently and endeavour to return money to the member states and the taxpayers we represent when we can. This proposal is uncosted. It is another example of how some members of this chamber are all too eager to make grand gestures with other people's money. A European diplomatic college would, is a waste of money and would become another burden on the taxpayer. I wish to remind colleagues that any common position on foreign policy would be determined by the member states represented in the Council, not by the Commission and certainly not by this Parliament. Any additional staff the EEAS require should be seconded from the member states and they require no separate training. The policy that they will represent to the world will be that of the Council of Ministers, not some independent European <coughs> policy. A diplomatic college would only become necessary if the EU were to take control of foreign affairs away from the member states. I hope that day never comes and I will do my utmost to prevent it. Thank you.